Sobriety tests and breathalyzers are just two ways police can check a driver's blood alcohol level, but a new tool is offering a different way to sense who's been drinking. This may seem like a typical flashlight, but the sniffer is more than what meets the eye. This device helps detect alcohol in a person's body. Five to ten inches away, police are able to better determine who was under the influence while driving. The goal of using the new PAS passive um, alcohol sensor flashlights is to help us detect, use it as a tool in the street to help us detect um, alcohol on impaired drivers mostly. One study shows that police using these devices see a 20% increase in the likelihood of catching drunk drivers. It also helps officers determine what the next step will be. They're just a tool to prompt the officer to ask the next question. Has this person been drinking? Should they go through some more tests? Um, and it, it just helps them know what to do next. One student is skeptical about the flashlight. I don't know how well they work, if they're that accurate, if you get like false readings or anything. And also, um, I think it's kind of an invasion of your privacy because it's not like a breathalyzer or something where you know that they're being used. It's just kind of, I mean, they can use them and not notify you of it. Officer Kelly Austin says it's the officer's choice to let people know when these flashlights are in use. Oh, they're very accurate. I mean, they will detect alcohol and they have a colored bar system. It ranges from green to yellow to red, depending on the amount of alcohol. State College resident Doug Hayward likes the idea. I don't see any problem with it. I think anything that can bring about uh, a reduction in drunk driving is a fantastic thing. The sniffer will only be used for drivers and will not be used on pedestrians. In State College, I'm Nate Lee reporting for the Center County Report. While these flashlights offer police a new way to test someone's blood alcohol count, police say they do not hold up in court and drivers cannot be found guilty solely by the use of this tool.